to do world space strategies another episode at it uh let's see what we're gonna do here um got a few couple more subscribers appreciate y'all coming out support this is just a game i've been playing since i was uh maybe four or five years old uh grandmother uh rest in peace taught me how to play spades and been playing ever since so uh yeah this is something that i like to do and um uh, Appreciate all the love and support. Continue to subscribe, share, like, whatever you want to do. It don't matter to me. We're going to go ahead and just get into it. So uh, I wanted to point out a few things what I've been playing lately is I haven't been playing a lot of partners because, you know, it's kind of difficult to get some good partners. You can tell I got three L's in a row. So that has a lot to do with your partners, but also, you know, sometimes you get some bad hands or whatever. Solo is pretty good, but a lot of where I've been getting a lot of my coins up at is the tournament. And I have five L's right here, but if you look at games one, I got 33 W's, first place in them tournaments. And them tournaments cash out, I think maybe 50K could get you maybe 900K or something like that. And if you do 100K, it could probably get you 1.2 M coins. So, yeah, so these tournaments is where it's been at. So, I'm a, this video right here is strictly we're going to hop in the tournament. See if we can change this luck. I'm on a five game losing streak, but sometimes I ain't won back to back. You could tell um, I, I got a win rate of 13%. I won 33 of these. So I've been doing pretty good lately. So let's get in here and see what to do. Uh, we're going to go right to the tournament solo. Yep. So the 100K get you uh, 1.2 M, but the 50K get you 600K. So. Uh, that's a nice little flip right there. If that was real life, you would be doing good. So uh, mm -hmm. let's go for it here. Uh, let's get in here. Uh, the good thing about this is you ain't have to worry about no partners, um, you know, messing up any hands or not playing what they're supposed to. It's strictly solo. Uh, each match is to 100. For the first two rounds, you just have to get to second place. And what I've learned in these tournaments is that you can be conservative. Be aggressive when they need to, like if you're back against the wall. But early out, start out, I would be conservative. Don't try to push anything. So if you look at my hand right here, you could tell I probably got about two. My clubs, I could catch it with the ace and then the queen of spades, I could get two. So diamonds and hearts, I really can't get nothing. So I don't want to force it. And the person next to me already bid it. They bid it too. So we could go with a two and see what it do. So yeah so I just start out be conservative it, you don't have to get first place you know so the person to the left of me already bid at five so they're gonna have a good comfortable lead after this round so all i have to do is beat out purple and orange that's all i have to do and i'll be all right you can set the red if you can if you got a good hand but it is doubted it's very doubtedly you could get that done so um let's just see what it do Play the A, so you really just want to throw things out. Um, maybe a few extra bags here to help you out, just because purple, orange, and me bid it two. So getting a couple bags will kind of give you a lead if y'all bid the same in the next round or in the future. So I will take any extra bags if you can right now. Don't worry about getting bagged and getting that penalty. A few extra bags here will help out a lot. So, you know, let's see here. I knew they was coming with the cut. That's fine. But that king of spade has already been played, so. And whatever's coming here, I'm taking it, so. Um, I'll take it here. I'm going to push spade just because I want to try to see if we can set that red. Hopefully someone can take that. See? Sometimes you just want to push it. Just, just to see what it does out there. And then I'll come with the seven. So it looked like the orange might be set here. So now I only have to worry about is purple. So it's like a, 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 let's see here, maybe a one person race just to get that, that second slot that's able to advance in the tournament. So orange set themselves, so that's perfect. We'll take that. And um, only thing is, purple have a one bag lead on us, but you never know. You could get it. The next hand could be great, or it could be even worse. So you never know. 
See here, I could probably make three. I probably could cut off on the diamond or the club. I know for sure I got the ace. Um, so just being conservative because it's still early in the rounds, I probably will go three. It's a force, but I'll just go three just to see what our luck take. And look, that's game right there. They have a five piece. I'm glad I bid it three just in case. See, three will get us the victory. So all we have to do is make our three. So since I have an ace and I have an ace of heart and a queen of heart, I don't want to play that initially. What I want to do is I want to try to see if that queen can walk. Hopefully someone can take. Let's see here. Okay, perfect. So if they play, so if red played heart, I could get the queen off. So now next time they come with the club, I'm cutting. And obviously they didn't, so they might be cutting. That's another thing you have to watch out for. So I'm going to throw off on the heart. Diamond, I'm cutting just to see what it does out there. And that's fine. So now I am for, I might put spade. I'm going to put spade here. Just because I want that queen of heart to walk. Okay. I think they may be cutting here. See, I know they was cutting here, so that's fine. She's stalling on that, so sometimes I might push this and see what I do. See, they cutting hearts anyway. So it, look, it looks like we're set here. Uh, look like we we may not be advancing, but that's all right. Sometimes people get a good hand here, and there's nothing you could do about it. There's nothing you could do about it, unless we bag them. And it looks like we are. We could bag them. Let's see. Oh wow. A loser. <laughs> That's fine, though. Oh, well, that's an L right there. Since that was just a first round exit, bad example, but sometimes it happens like that. There's nothing you had to do. We had to force your hand. We started off conservative, but we came aggressive the second hand, and we didn't get the results that we want. So sometimes what I like to do is I hop right back in. It's easily to get one of these games, and it's only 50k coins. If you go and play one of those 250k, 100k, you know, it's not a lot of risk and gamble, but you more than likely have a 50% chance, chance of winning or losing. But let's just hop back in another tournament, same rules as before, and let's see what our luck do. See, right here we got a way better hand. That king of heart, that's going to be one. I'm going to cut off on the diamond, that's two. Then I have a ten of spade, J spade, and a Q spade. I'm looking at maybe about five, so, uh, yeah, let's go five. We have a full board here, so somebody may be getting set if somebody get an extra bag. Perfect. Now our king of heart is going to walk, unless red is cutting, which... I knew that was coming. Uh, but see, it's a lot of going. It's a lot of commotion going on now, because hearts is cutting and diamonds is cutting. So that's fine here. What we're gonna do? We're gonna throw off one of these spades, because I know he was going diamonds. We're gonna throw off one of these. I mean, not spades, but clubs. And now he's gonna come back to heart. And now we're gonna take this. That's fine. Still might be hard to get this five. It's looking like maybe a set. Yep. See, if one get one, then we're set. Yep. It's kind of tough, man. You know, the terms is kind of tough. If you don't get a good rhythm, they're kind of tough. So this this is a bad sequence right here. 
I kind of went against my rule. I got a little too aggressive. You see? Cheers. <laughs> you know, we got little trolls here. See, that's the difference between being uh, aggressive early and being conservative early. So now you're basically out the game. Unless you have a miraculous comeback or anything like that. But that's the difference between being aggressive. I got a little aggressive on the second time around. And this time around, the first time I got conservative. So here, I'm going to go two, three, four. Two, four. I'll probably go seven here. I'm going to go seven. See, if I would have went, let's say, three in the first round being conservative, this bid, this hand right here will, will be going to the next round. So. So now we're going to come right back because I'm pretty sure he's cutting. You play your king unless you got the queen of spades. So we'll come right back there. And he's cutting. That's obvious. Okay. So we'll take that. And then we'll come with the heart. I don't want to play that king card just in case someone's cutting. So I'm going to go over to the diamond since I have nothing to lose. See? Perfect. So now that walked. We're going to come back over here and play another diamond. Come here. Cut that. They push a spade. I know the king. Yep, there we go. That's fine, though. We're going to try to throw this off. Okay, we're going to take this. It's looking like another set. Ooh, that was lucky. That was lucky, but we back in the game a little bit here now. We back in the game here. That's crazy. That's crazy. That four heart walk walked for me to get my seven bag. That was very aggressive, but we had nothing to lose. And look, another good hand here. We in the game now. So look, that diamond, I got two over there. I'm going to cut one of those hearts. That's three. I got the king and the jack. So I'm going to go five here. We in the game. We in the game, baby. That's all we need. See, now the blue went, so they have an 80. So, look, we're going to go here. We're going to go to low heart. We got to try to break this kneel. We have to try to break this kneel. We can't afford to give up second place to get a good lead like that. And it's bad that I had to. Th that's the only thing I had, if you can see. But we're going to come back low. We're trying to break that kneel. They went desperate. Boom. There we go. That's all we needed. I'm going to throw off this diamond. See, look, we good. We good money now. We we back. We second place. We second place right now. I'm going to go ahead and take that. That's fine. Here. That's another one. No, we're good. We're good now. We're going to the second round now. And that walked as well. So, yeah, we, we definitely in a good place right now. Getting a few extra bags. We might have to go for this set for the red. I think we may be able to pull it off. We could take this. Let's throw this five spade out. But well, we think we got it. Yep, we got him. We can have a, we could toast to a cigar right here. 
So we got that set now. Perfect. Broke the nail and we set red. It, it, it didn't get no better than that. You see how we get back in the game like this? That's all it. Listen, you can. That's why it's always better to start off conservative. That way you can be in a run in. I started off a little too aggressive, but I came back and look, I might get first place. For sure, I'm going to the next round. So I'll probably just go one book here. Just a conservative. There's no way that blue can bid eight or nine and get second place. And there's no way red can bid six or seven and get second place. So what we're going to do here is we're going to go. Even if we go two, we'll be fine. Even if we don't make the two, we'll still have 52 points to their red possibly. What? 31 and blue, uh, 39. So we're good here. We don't want no five bag penalty. That'll, that'll take us a little less. We'd rather get set than get a penalty. So we're fine there. Now I get these high ones out of our hand. Can I go here and take care of that? Ace of club. Throw a high diamond out. Get that out of our hand. So yeah, we're going off to we're going to the second round, baby. It's time to cheers and celebrate and have a cigar. You know. Cut that. See if that'll walk. If not, that's fine. We don't care. We're going to the second round. We just don't want to get no five back penalty. That's perfect. Uh, now nah, they might try to set the orange, but I doubt they set the orange. But they're trying, so you can tell that's their strategy. And that's what it's all about, space strategy. Here we go. That's probably going to get to by the orange, and that lets us know if we're going up. Oh, yep, yeah, still going to the second round. We thought I'd see if they got it. That king, yep, that king club. We're all good now. Next round. What a comeback. Was down 50. Down 50 after the first first hand. Down 50. Caught a little luck. Caught a little luck. Got a seven bid. That four, what was that? The four of hearts walked. Got us back into, what, positive 20. Got a good five hand after that. And now we're here. We're going to the second round. We live to fight another day. Here we go, and they already ready to go. And they already ready to go. So let's see what let's see what to do. So we're gonna start off a little conservative. We're not gonna do like we did last game, be a little aggressive. So um I'm gonna say two here. King, king, spade, queen, heart, spade, definitely. But when it's a kneel, we can always add an extra bag so i'll go three here just to see we can still be in a good running i always go an extra bag when they go kneel they got a seven we got a full board something's not right here <laughs> so let's see okay yep yeah. Maybe our queen of diamond could walk now. Unless they're cutting it. Unless the blue is cutting it. Let's see here. And I'm pretty sure blue is cutting. Yep, I knew that was coming. So now we might be set here. But that's fine. So we'll come here. Then we'll go with the ten of club just to see. Go this ten of heart. Hey, see it. They got everything. It's nothing we could do about that. 
They had they had a great hand. Look at that hand. Look at that hand. There's nothing you can do about that. But they covered, so. Yeah, yeah. These type of hands happen. You gotta go against this. Yeah, I, it's no way you could come back. You down 80. Me and red is down 30. There's no way you could come back from this. And especially blue only got a bid three and they going to the championship. But that's fine here. So let's see. Uh, I'm just going to go four. Just go four. Don't hurt. We already, you know, this is just a throw it out there. See what it does. Okay, blue. Playing a little conservative. They playing a little conservative. Okay, let's go ahead. I'm going to throw the king uh, club just to get that out of my hand. Cutting the next one out the rip. Someone come on a club, cutting it out the rip. Yep, there we go. Okay, so now what I, I kind of want to set this blue if I can. So I'm going to push this diamond. Okay, now they're going to come with something on the club. Maybe a club or the hearts will be perfect. Okay, they're going to come here. We have to take this. We want to save that four spade to see if that could walk on the club if they play. We're going to come right back to the diamond. Okay, perfect. We want to keep the hand in front of us. Keeping the hand in front of us means letting blue always throw something out. So we come in here, take that, and then we're going to push another diamond. We're gonna cut that. Perfect, perfect. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna. I don't know. This it should it be diamond or the heart? Let's go heart, and then let them figure out the rest. I would have liked to go diamond, but it's no way we could set the blue. But setting up, I had no more spades. There's no way I could have. Set the purple. But they're done. Red is done. You never know. So just play it out. Another thing I suggest too is just play it out. Don't, even if you got a if behind on the cards like this, just play it out. You never know what could happen. You never know what kind of hand you could get an eight or a nine hand. Just play it out. Just play it out. Don't quit. Don't give up. See here? I'll probably go kneel here. Just to, you know, just, you know, you, ne you never know. Let's see. And they have three bags. Blue, they could get set. They could get a five-bag penalty. See, red still playing it out. They're not giving up. Purple going one, yeah. So what I, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna go kneel here. It's nothing else I could do. Maybe blue could get some extra bags. You never know. So let's see. Red might be a little disgruntled. That's fine. I know the hearts is looking shaky on the kneel, especially on a solo. Kneels on solo is the hardest things in the world. Hardest things. You have everybody's against you. Everybody. You got three on one. A kneel on a regular partner game. You have someone that's they have your best interest because they're trying to win too. But on a solo, a kneel on a solo. We got one more chance just to get this nine of heart out of our hand. We'll be fine. And then we can just live with the results. They go diamond, red go diamond. We're fine. But blue throwing off. They know they don't want to get bagged. So let's go here. 
three as well. Perfect. See, red is trying to set blue, but she should have just bagged him. She should have just bagged him. She fell right into his hand. And yep, there we go. Oh. Let's see if she could set. If red set, we we we're back in here. I doubt it, but you know, just play it out. You never know. They're thinking. When they get when the timer go out, they're thinking. Up oh, that's game. Oh, well, we tried. We tried. We made it to the second round. It was a good. It was a good, it was a good run, but you know, maybe next time we can get a W. And they had the ace of red made a mistake. She should have just bagged them. They just needed two bags, one because they got one there. They just needed one bag, but that's fine. We'll take it there. That 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 set, what was that? A fifty set? No, that was a thirty set that we, um, the first the first hand where we lost. Um, but yeah, these tournaments sometimes you know it, it's here and there, hit or miss. But uh, you know, play it out. Be conservative. Be conservative early, and see what it does. So, all right. Good luck, world. Space strategies. Another episode. Subscribe, share, like. Do what you want. Do what you can. Have a good one. Stay, stay positive, and uh, I'll catch y'all on the next one. All right. We out.